Good morning. Happy Monday. So, how was your weekend? Mine was great because I got to spend it with my my cousins, my sweet cousins. Um, it was wonderful. I really enjoy them. I don't get to see them enough. And, you know, I should work on that myself. <sighs> so it's Monday again. Time to start over. So I'm using Dickinson's Hydrating Toner with Rose Water. I'm going to try this stuff again. Essie? Essie? Something. Oops. Let's see what happens. If some of it was dry. Where, oh where? There we go. Alright. See what happened. We got. What is the deal, Lucille? Oh, great. I guess it's dry skin. How is it dry skin when I put put on all my accoutrement, accoutrement, accoutrement all my cream? <laughs> Okay. Yeah. See what happens. It burns a little. Okay. Put this around everywhere else. Azura hemp and aloe. Like I said before, this stuff is old that I put down there, so it might not work. Oh, oh, oh. We'll see. We'll see what happens. All right, I'm trying to get the extra glue off my eyelashes because I am wearing them today. Today, today. Hmm. Okay, now, I took stuff with me, but I, I came in and I put stuff up, which could be an issue. Jerome Alexander Airbrush. NYX primer. Why do my hands get hands glue? That's that cream stuff. Got stuff everywhere, y'all. Everywhere. Mm. Why? Why? Look how it does not. Maybe it just the lighting on this tablet doesn't like I think it has a problem like following me <laughs> and that's why it gets bright it's like where'd she go she's fluorescent and she's disappeared <laughs> I know I'm weird 
I'm silly. Somebody asked me what blush I was using. And I just, I, I was at my um, cousin's, so I didn't have it. I didn't bring it. I forgot it. But Pixie by Petra. Ginger Blossom. That's the one I use. All right. I just brought these two brushes. Maybe I need to get some special something that takes, because even when I wash them, this stuff is just embedded in them, you know? Let's see, look. Now, this is not, this is from two brushes that I took with me this weekend. <coughs> see how this turns out. Um, well, I have to have that. Oh, there it is. Going in with this. Foera. There we go. White. 200. Oh, 201. Sorry. Number 201. Eyebrows. Let's do our eyebrows first. Oh. Profusion brows. Lighting. Noelle's over there snoring. She had a good time this weekend. All the family came over. She got to see everybody. I think she was a little overwhelmed. We did FaceTime with the ones that couldn't come. It was nice. I was happy to be with them and share. Okay, this is what I'm going to use today. Teal eyeshadow palette. The shirt I'm wearing, well, I'm wearing the scarf that goes with this headband, but the shirt 
that I'm wearing is the pink one with really bright colors. So I'm gonna do a little, a little work with these colors. I didn't put the white on first. See, look, already, already. is actually putting on white pretty well and the color on the tablet it's like it loses me if I have my hand in front of my face it's like where did she go she's so bright colored <laughs> I am a bright color bright white Y'all, I used to burn. I'd get in the sun and I would burn. I literally can feel it when the sun is on me. It's not just heat. It's like, it feels like it starts to burn. It's just the way my skin is. This is life, people. This is life. Spring. Spring has sprung, y'all. I think it's tomorrow. Tomorrow's the first day of spring. I think that's what the news said this morning. I do believe that's what it said. Come on now. Lighting. Oh, Melissa, as soon as I get finished with, uh, I'm almost finished with the newest shrug. If I finish that today, I don't know how much work I'm going to have to do today. I'm going to start on that, uh, new stitch. Um, the one with the flowers, the flower stitch from the book that you got me. It's going to be so pretty. I'm doing red roses. I hope, well, they'll turn out. They will turn out. I know this for a fact, okay? <laughs> I know I'm weird. I'm a weirdo. But you know what? It don't matter anymore. Not with my age. I don't care. Ocean. There's nothing like where I live, you drive for quite a few miles on I-45 and at the end of I-45 is the Gulf Coast, the ocean there. And when you come on it, come upon it, and you first see the ocean, I mean, you see it when you go over the bridge, but it's not the same. When you get to the beach and seeing all the, the water, it's just magical. It's a magical feeling. 
Even though I've lived here my whole life, it's always magical when I get to the ocean. My daughter-in-law, a first time, you know, she'd never seen the ocean. She's in a landlocked state, and she just hasn't ever seen the ocean until, you know, she came down here. And uh, I wasn't with them. I would have loved to have seen her reaction, but I do know that she told, told us, the family, that it was like being in a movie. I guess in a way it could be. You've got the pier with all the rides on it. You know? I guess it could be. I'm using the white to calm it down. Uh-oh. Got my eyebrow. I have to fix that. Calm down. Calm down, eyeshadow. I feel much better today. I was really, really depressed on Saturday. I hate it. I hate it. You know? I'm adding a touch of green, literally a touch. Hmm, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking I got to wash these. I wasn't here this weekend to wash them. And I don't have but just a smidge. So I need to put them in the wash at least before I leave. Get all this off my fingers before I transfer it to the rest of my face. Y'all know what I did? Gluing these fingernails on. Can you see? There's two of them there. Two of them! I'm getting that make about from under them. As we're talking. Oopsie. Two of them. <laughs> I'm a weirdo, I know. Okay. That's the wave. Silver. That one. The wave. So what did I use today? I used that and that, a touch of that and that. Noelle had a big weekend. I guess that's why she's so sleepy. She was not about to eat her dog food while she was there. So a whole can went to waste. Half yes, or day before yesterday and we and went that night and then the next night. Or next day. She sure did. I'm like, you can't be wasting that stuff, honey. It costs too much money. Honey. Money, honey. All right. I clean some of my mess up. Blue is messy. P 
period paragraph. It's messy. People still say period paragraph. Because I do. But I'm also going to be 55 in August. Cut a good line, didn't it? That one did too. Huh. Oh, I didn't look to see if that did anything. It didn't look. It's just coming off and... That's what I get for playing around while I'm trying to get ready on Monday. No playing around no more. Let me get it off. Where did I do with it? You, my friend, are trash. Barking in her sleep. She's chasing a squirrel. <laughs> Young Focus Contour Series. I'm going to go back in and, and do some more blending. Let me get this on. Go ahead and put this on. And then I'll go ahead and do a little bit more blending. Because when I'm looking in this camera, I see it needs to be blended more. And not with just my finger. I need a brush. A blending brush. Uh-oh. I'm seeing the bottom of the pan now in this. I don't know how much it costs either. Because I've had it for a long time. Before dad passed away, things were easier. Right now, I have to figure out how to pay bills. One bill at a time, you know? Cause it's just me now. It's hard to live, on, especially when mine is not that great. I do believe that Starbucks, uh, Shift managers make more than I do. If I'm, that's what I was told. So there you go. <laughs> and I'm almost 55. If I could do it again, y'all, I'd go, I'd be in college and y'all would have to, I'd still be in college. <laughs> Honestly, I wouldn't. Obviously, I couldn't pay for all that, but I would have. Just stay in school. Stay in school. Believe me. It is the best. The best for you. Stay in school. I can't. That one's got too much. Too much. <sighs> no. Gray. It's not a good blending brush. I need a bigger one. But whatever.
Hold on a minute. I see some eyebrows that need to come out. Like I said, I need to get the wax machine out and really wax it, my eyes. My face, really. I have that peach fuzz all over my face. See, I can see them. Pinch the crap out of my face. Well, that's better. See, you can see them in the camera, but they're like really light colored and you can't see them if you're just looking. And you know what? If somebody gets this close to my face, they better propose. <laughs> Which, of course, I'm going to say no. I couldn't deal with it again. Oh, I couldn't deal with it again. I went through so much crap. Hopefully they will never find me on YouTube. <laughs> None of them. Okay? None of them. There's a few. I have a few ex-husbands. And I have one ex. The last one I ever dated was back in 2000. 10 and 11. Yep. He was a scary person. He put me in the hospital, y'all. Yeah? And I don't deal with that kind of mess. I don't go for that. He went to jail. For, before he went to jail, though, I had to hide from my cousins in Houston for over a year. And then after that, I came back and I, I brought my RV because I had it hit out too because that's what I had sold. Mama died, right? And I met him. I was so sad and so lonely. So I uh, met him. He was not my normal type if there is one really. And uh, we dated, but he was very verbally abusive. And um, I tried to get away from him, but I couldn't. He, I mean, literally, I couldn't. So... Um, called my great aunt and told her after he had put me in the hospital I called her and I told her I said uh help and that's all she needed to know she didn't know what was happening so we me dad and her and my cousin it's my cousin's house I went to where my great aunt lives so it was, I had sold Mama's house, right? I still had a note. I couldn't afford it. And I bought an RV, and I was living in an RV. And I was living there with him. And like I said, I would try to get rid of him, but I couldn't. He would come back. I had, before I sold Mama's house, I had <clears throat> thought I would gotten rid of him. And I went and took a shower. And, um, I came out of the bathroom. And he was hiding behind the bar in the kitchen. And I had called the police, but that was no help. The law is no help. So, whatever. I couldn't get rid of him. After he hit me and put me in the hospital, I um, called dad and my great aunt 
So he used my car to go to work. So I had to get my car back, right? I had We had to hide the RV, hide me, and get my car back. We had to do all this. It had to work perfectly. So when he went to work, Dad and my great aunt showed up. My great aunt showed up. I put the stuff in the truck that I would need in Houston. And I took, put the stuff that I didn't need in Dad's truck. And I hired a guy to come, because it's a fifth wheel. I hired a guy to come get it at the same time. He took it to my friends um, to hide it out. And um, my great aunt left with my stuff. I left with Dad. And I had a, I called him and I told him I was at Dad's to come get me when he got off work. So he came in my car and I was already prepared. Everything was in Houston already. And my RV was gone. He didn't know it. And so I got in the car. He was driving, of course. And I told him to stop at the gas station up the road. And when he stopped at the gas station, I told him to stop on the side because I didn't feel good. I felt like I was going to throw up, which wasn't true. Well, maybe a little. Anyway, he, uh, he got out of the car. And when he made that corner, I jumped into the driver's seat and I took off to Houston. And months went by. And I, wanted, I came to see Dad. And Dad was not here. My half-brother was not here. It's just me by myself. I was sitting on the couch and I heard, I heard him on the street hollering for me. And I hit the deck. And I, I mean, I, so he couldn't see me through the patio door. And I came into here, into my dad's room. And so I could peek out the side. And I called dad. I was terrified, man. I was shaking. I was crying. Well, about the time my half-brother pulled up and he, when my half-brother pulled up, my half-brother's huge. He's a huge man. And, uh. Huge, tall, big man. And he chased him in the car, his truck. He chased him. And um, he, he was gone. And I haven't seen him since, thank God. All right. Now, okay. I've talked enough. I've had a chaotic life. I really have horrible some things. So, I understand about the abuse, physical and mental abuse. I never would have thought that I would have gotten into a relationship like that. I've had the physical, I mean, mental abuse, but never the physical. You know why? I don't think I could do any better. That's exactly it. I didn't think I could do any better. So there you go. All right, let's go ahead and put some glue on. AOA, what does that say? Studio. Studio, I just remembered. Hence, I'm alone now. I can't afford nothing. But you know what? Sometimes, there's nothing worse, worth your peace being taken away from, from you. I have peace here. I'm not, my cousin told me that she didn't think that they were ever gonna get me back. Mentally, I was so whacked out.
right. Put it on here. I wore these Friday. I didn't wear any this weekend. Gave my eyes a break, my eyelids. I need to show y'all what I did, the way I did my makeup this weekend. When I, the makeup I had on Saturday, I slept in, right? Well, the next morning, I, um, I'm going to have to show y'all. Maybe I'll, if I remember, maybe I will, well, I don't like this makeup for every day, this eyeshadow. Remind me, when I do the brown eyeshadow, because I'd rather do that for two days in a row. I'll show you what I'm talking about, how I got ready on yesterday. Because this is not something I'm gonna wear two days in a row. It's a bold, Look. Um, this is the Essence Lash Without Limits. And the other was... You have to look for this, but it's the primer. These two things came together. Is there even something under here? It's Lash Princess Mascara Primer. Anyway. They came together on Amazon. I'm so glad Tom Tom's better. I was so worried about him. I kept thinking the way he was hurting and walking. I'm like, and I could see that there was a swelling, but I couldn't move the hair to look, really look at it or touch it because it hurt him so bad. And I know if anybody's had an abscess, you know, like a tooth even, God knows my teeth are fried. Um, FYI, there's something new. My cousin found out about it. Unfortunately, I didn't know about it. But my teeth, I've had massive steroids. I took massive amounts of steroids because my liver transplant. Well, my teeth have wore down. They wore down. It wasn't cavities because I went to the teeth, to the doctor, dentist. It wasn't cavities. But they wore down. They have a something now that they can go in and you need to ask before they sit there and say, oh, you got to have a crown. you got to have a crown. Costs over a $1,000 a tooth. There's something. Because that that's what I didn't understand. Because back in the day, I know silver. Who wants silver? But they came out with the white stuff. Anyway, there's something they can put on your teeth that's wore down. That saves them. My teeth now are not savable. They need to be pulled out and I need a denture. I can't afford one. I can't afford that. So I have to live with what I have for now. That's very unfortunate. I wish I'd have known. I do. Make sure you get all the fuzz off. <gasps> Oops. So it doesn't go in your eyeball. It's 
especially my right eye. So at least my right eye. extra glue right there. All right, I'll fix it. Dad gum it, come on. Did I tell y'all that I checked in on the um, boxes, P.O. boxes? They are ridiculously expensive, so I can't afford that either. <laughs> I am going to get some relief when I get my um, car paid off in a few months. Wet n' Wild, multi color icon, multi sick, semi matte, calm waters, calm waters. All right, what are you? Fix that where the glue is. Right. Looking good. Now let's see if I can replicate it. <laughs> it's always hard to do it twice. Especially when I can't see. This eye is messed up. And it's hard to see. Yeah, I can see where it's not real straight. Again, if somebody gets as close to me, they better propose. Still not going to say yes, but they better do it anyway. Okay. 
right now. Wipe up when you do that. Towards that way. Wipe up when you screw up. Ha! Huh? That rhymes. Okay, so that's the darkest color. And that's the lightest color, wave. She's not gonna be happy with me when I leave, but I can't help it. I gotta go to buy her dog food. Actually, I do have to go, if I get a break today, I'll run to Walmart and get her, her dog food. Do y'all know six cans of the cheaper dog food is, uh, is right at 10 bucks? For now, it'll probably go up more. It might be even more. Okay. Good. 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 There. There. If y'all want to know what I'm doing, I'm spraying my setting spray into the lid. I'm put it, getting this wet with it. And then I'm using the same colors. Well, except for I had to do all the way across the darkest color. On this little tiny brush. Darkest color. And because of the glue, I did the darkest color all the way across the top. Clean your brush real good. Then dip it in and use your... But y'all be careful, okay? Because I've already had one person tell me that it burnt their eyes. So... Be very careful, very careful. I don't know. Oh, I, I put too much in there. Y'all, don't let me forget, I have got to wash these things or I'm not gonna have any left. Cody Airsprung, uh, translucent. I put it in the lid. Out of here. Um, using my Pixie by uh, Petra. It is Ginger Blossom. I don't know where I got it. When I was going through stuff, I found it. I don't know why I didn't use it before, unless, I don't know. I just didn't care for it, maybe, at the time. I don't know. 
I like it now. I do, I do. If anybody would like to write to me, please use my email. It's just like my title or the name of this page. It's Kathy's Crochet Creations at gmail.com. And Creations is spelled with a K. Kathy is spelled with a K. So K A T H Y S K R, I'm sorry, C R E A T I O N S. Let me get it right. K A T H Y S, Kathy's. Crochet, C-R-O-C-H-E-T, creations, K-R-E-A-T-I-O-N-S at gmail.com. There we go. <laughs> mm. I have a thingy that you can put from my teeth up here, but when I do that, you really can't hear me. You understand me. So I don't wear it. Which I should because the guy... Dennis said if I didn't wear it. Where is it? Okay, y'all know this is gross. I'm going to do it off camera. Hold on. Teeth. Why he? But when I talk, I talk like this. Like I got a lisp and I can't. I don't know why it's like that. I can't do it. It's like I got a mouthful of marbles. I know that was gross. I apologize. <laughs> I'm a weirdo. I can't help it. I'm very, very upfront and open about things. Look at that. I got, I got dead gum powder in my eyelashes. No. Okay. <laughs> it's not the end of the world. And also, I have a nose hair trimmer, but I have not been able to find that for a long time. Can you tell? <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I'll quit being gross. Ooh, it's 5.44, y'all. Gotta quit farting around and get this done. Oh my gosh, I've been going 52 minutes on here. I'm sorry. It's gonna take a year for it to upload. Hmm. Where is, is it on here? Oh, yep, it is. It is, it is. I know y'all aren't into all this red and blue. But you know what it reminds me of? The 60s. Anybody else? Does it remind you of the 60s? And 70s? Blue eyeshadow and red lips. <laughs> and a big old fake ponytail. <laughs> All right. I love y'all. God bless you. And I will see you this evening to get this off, probably. <laughs> All right. Bye.